Hello, this is Mr. One, aka the Icon. Um, I got another story to tell. Um, it happened when I was like, it was 10 years ago, a little bit more than 10 years ago. I was like 20, 21. And um, I remember I bought some uh, out of the to the school, a fifth out of the school. You know what I'm saying? We was drinking. I ain't mad nothing, thinking nothing about it. You know what I'm saying? So, um, I'm chilling with the guys and shit, you know, the gang, the fellow gang bangers I used to kick it with. So it's like, so it's like, um, <clears throat> damn, uh, the fellow gang bangers I used to kick it with. We drinking and shit, you know. We had the motherfucking front of school, got everybody, uh, everybody bought their cups, and so we drinking and shit. So it was this one little white girl, I forgot her name is, man. We, used to, I forgot the, forgot her name, but I remember her face. But she was pretty, you know what I'm saying? Nice, nice, decent body, long, blonde hair, uh, blue eyes. Little pretty white girl, you know what I'm saying? You know, she was living with one of the guys. She was one of the guys' girlfriends. So I ain't paying her no mind. She asked for a cup, you know what I'm saying? I said, okay, you can get a cup, you know what I'm saying? You one of the guys' girl. So, uh, mind you, I'm not bogus when I end this story. So, you know what I'm saying? Um, that's why I thought at the time, at, at that moment, I thought she was one of the guys' girl. So I was like, okay, you know, so you get a cup, we drink it, shit, cracking jokes, you know what I'm saying? So we all drunk and shit, so uh, we joking around. So after that, you know, I, I eventually also t- 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 uh, talked to my bitch when I was, uh, uh, my fault, I'm sorry, my girl at the time. My girl in my command, so I'm talking to her, we walked the bed, we did some things, we were drunk and shit, so we did some things, and then we eventually walked. off. So uh, I lived on Laverne Congress, so at the time, you know, my command closed at nine, so... I, I dipped off, you know, we, I went to the blue line, me and my mans uh, went to the blue line, he was telling me, the white girl, no, I see me and my mans, my mans girl, the white girl said, you know, she want to go to the thing, I'm drunk as shit, you know what I'm saying, now I'm, I'm slack drunk, you know what I'm saying, so, I, I said like, you know, shorty, like, where you going, like, you know, she said, he said, he said, he said well, my, um, he said, I got a visit my, um, my friend, he know with Pulaski. I said, okay, you going the same way as me. So I'm drunk as hell. My man was telling me like, dog nah, man, look, man, she trying to sleep with you out the bed. I'm like, man, shorty, I'm finna look, look, man, she finna, we going the same way. She trying to stay, I'm going on Pulaski. So we go, we go on a bus, you know what I'm saying? On the train, I mean, on the blue line. And then we with Pulaski, I said, okay, shorty, uh, you know, you got it, you got the, uh, Got on the restroom, you know, the restroom, and you got kids, and then the Pulaski came up. I said, Sure, they still stop. She said, Well, I think she, he stay off Central. I said, Okay, cool. I can walk you up there because I stay off Central. Road. You know what I'm saying? I stay off Central. Road. She said, Okay. He said, I think it's on the left. I'm, I'm drunk. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, Okay, you know what I'm saying? You say, okay, we, I said, I said, okay, I said, I stay on the right. She said, all right, back. So we got off on Cicero. Cicero's the next stop from Pulaski. So I said, okay, we got off Cicero. I said, okay, all right, you know, shorty, you know, you be careful out here because, you know, you're a pretty white girl, you know. These niggas ain't, yeah, these niggas, you know, it's like, you know, they, they, ain't, they, ain't, they, ain't, they, ain't, they ain't built, you know, they ain't wrapped too right, you know what I'm saying? So I said, I know why I think he stay on the right side. I said, okay, I can walk you over there, you know, this is my, this is my land, you know what I'm saying? Everybody know me, so you straight. We walking. I said, okay, well, you got to go. She said, I think it's right here. So she followed everywhere I go, walking behind me. We walked the bed. I said, hey, okay, whatever. So she said, I think she's saying, he said, so I walked to my building. I said, okay, well, I don't know where you finna go, but this is my building. She said, um, I think he, she, uh, I think he's staying in this building. I said, no, now nah, let me check this out. And I, it's a, when I was staying there, I was, it was a four bedroom apartment, not four, but a four room, four room apartment, you know what I'm saying? And then, I know everybody in my fucking, my fucking building. It's a one old woman, well, actually, one old woman, her damn daughter, and this old man that stay upstairs in front of, uh, above us. So I was like, nah, I don't think, nah, I don't know about all that. So my dad, I not know, my dad, I said, she says she's trying to meet somebody up here. My dad said, you stupid motherfuckers, she's trying to be with you. I said, oh, okay. I said, so, I like, long, my ain't going to say long story short, so we got in the house, you know what I'm saying? I got a uh, went to the thing. I said, you want a bill? She said, you want a bill? I said, okay, I understand. Now I understand my slow ass. I said, you don't got nowhere to go. You can sleep on the couch. She said, how about I just stay sleep in your room? I said, okay. Look, I, uh, we broke. We don't got no bed. I said, I sleep on the flow. I've been sleeping on the flow out west for seven years. So it's like, I don't got no bed. I sleep on the fucking flow. So she said, it's, it's cool. So, you know. I lay down. I was not, not, now mind you, I'm thinking this is my man's girl. So I said, she, she laid that to me. I'm laying that to her. 
So I was, I'm finna fall asleep. She got a kiss on my neck. I'm moving around. I, you know, this my man's girl. I don't want to be on that. You know what I'm saying? Like, damn, this my man's girl. You know what I'm saying? This is my man's girl. So I said, he said, she kissed my neck. I'm moving around. She said, what? You don't want me? I said, shit, I do. My dick hard than a motherfucker. But, shorty, check this out. You my man's girl. She said, well, I, you know, I ain't fucking, um, I, you know, yeah, we, we kissed. We, we used to date, we used to date, but yeah, we, he broke up with me. We were out of bed. Now, when you young and stupid, you got this pretty bad white bitch in your bed. Well, on the, on, well, we was on the rug. That was my bed, so leave me alone. Uh, we was on the rug. So I was like, shorty, I'm finna do your ass in. You know what I'm saying? You young, you know what I'm saying? I'm, you know what I'm saying? I don't have no remorse. I don't have no regrets about it. You know what I'm saying? It is what the fuck it is. So I'm doing a, and then I, because we doing, we doing, we doing what we doing, you know what I'm saying? So I said, dang. All right. She said, how many chicks you slept with? I bet it's a lot. I said, no, nah, I ain't that much. I, you know what I'm saying? I probably like two. I say two. I say two to every female. I say two because it's my first one and you. My last one. I'm not finna count every every uh, female I stuck with in between. Two. You and the first one I had sex with. That's it. That's all. I'm not finna remember every woman I've been with. Man, it's gonna take me all damn day. You know what I'm saying? I'm just speaking factual. I just said just two. The first and the last. That's it. Everything else is supreme on the top. That's it. That's all. So, um... So I said, how we so you know, I don't have no conversation with her. I never really talked to her. So she said like she must have had a crush on me for a while. So she said that like, you know, how many I said, how many guys you have sex with? She said twenty three. I said, damn, huh? Uh, damn, that's a kinda a lot for a female. That's a lot. She said, in the summer. I said, God damn, um shit, man, shit, uh fuck. I said, then I'm now, mind you, I'm fucking this bitch raw. When she told me twenty three in the summer, I'm like, damn. God, my dick gonna fall. I pissed my dick gonna fall in the toilet or some shit. Uh, you know, I mean, 23 in the summer, that's a lot, man. It definitely, now imagine, I remember the day because it, it stunned me so fucking bad. The summer didn't even fucking really start yet. I'm talking about, it was like June 13th or something like that. Like, man, that shit, August ain't even hit yet. You fuck 23 already? I was like, damn, I must be like 20. Oh, man, damn, this bitch up. So, uh, in the morning, we got up, you know, I, I, I got up, we did it. She she did something to me. I ain't going to say say all that, but she cooked she could me some breakfast and did something to me. Which, ooh, out the bam. So, we, uh, I do, see, me, I'm cool. I was, I was just the, the cool motherfucker, so I knew everybody. I knew the bus, the bus, the, the train stop dude. I knew, because I, I was broke. I mean, I'm not going to start, I'm not going to say I was the rich, the motherfucker had money. I was fucking broke. So in the way, in order to me to get on the train and go to Malcolm X was to get cool with these motherfuckers so they could go outside smoke so they don't have to see me hopping the rails. So I said, what's up? He said, man, I see this dude I talk to every day. He was my man. So he, oh, pretty boy ass motherfucker, man. He used to work the motherfucker, uh, the blue line train. He was a, like a conductor or something like that. All he do is sit there and smoke cigarettes and hire females. But, you know, you don't need to know that. He was my man. So I was talking to him. We walked the bed. He said, man, I see you got a nice little honey. I said, you always with, he said, you always with the honeys, man. You always got nice. I said, man, this is my man's girl. He said, oh, all right. Yeah, man, you said, you finna go to the blue line? I mean, yeah, to go to the blue line, the train? I said, yeah. So I hopped the rails. And then we walk it downstairs. We were walking down this little suit. It's not no downstairs. We ain't had no downstairs out west. It's just damn suit. Like it's a, I don't know what the fuck this shit called. It's just walking down to the train dock. So, uh, she, she sat down. She got to kissing on me and shit, kissing my cheeks because I, the, the nasty thing she did to me, I ain't gonna let her kiss my lips. You know what I'm saying? See, I told you I got some lips. And, um, uh, shorty like, damn. I said, I just took my man's girl up all night. I don't think she, you know what I'm saying? I said, damn, I got face dude ass. You know, t uh, uh, today and shit, cause I gonna, cause everybody know I'm, uh, I'm smack, I smack Shorty, you know what I'm saying? Cause she went home with me, cause I know my man's ain't kept his mouth shut. There, yeah, I went home with Shorty, so she got off. Uh, she got off. No, I got off of uh, Michael Myers gave her a hug. She said, "Call me." I ain't had a bitch number. I was not about to ask for the bitch number. So she dipped, and then I went to Michael Max. My man showed up. I said, "Damn, fire!" That's the name. Fire showed up. Like, fire said, I heard you fuck one of my bitches. I said, okay, since it's one of your bitches, 
Yeah. Yeah. He said, oh, it's no mind. You cool, man. Shit. She probably out here doing Dino's anyway. So I said, okay, man. But long, the moral of the story is, find out the whole truth before you smash them. Thank you for listening to my story. God bless.